Get out of here. I said no solicitors. You too, lady? I'm not interested. Welcome back, everybody, to Undead Legacy. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we're going to make more trips to the traders. Um, because one of you guys told me in the comments that one of the trader gens has a nail gun, uh, but uh, you didn't say which trader gen had a nail gun. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure if who left that comment. I don't remember who it was off the top of my head. Uh, <clears throat> knew which one it was either. So I figured, all right, well, <coughs> excuse me. Let's go around and check the three trader gens that I know of. There's one in, here in the snow, one up in the desert, and one back in the wasteland. And I need more oil shale anyway. So when we go up to the desert, I'm going to stop and um, get a little bit of that too. Uh, so what I've done is I have gathered up um, so a few a spare weapons and armor. Uh, I guess I already have those in my inventory because I figured we might as well, you know, sell that too while we're here. Okay, so let's check this trader gin first. You're looking kind of rough. And see if she's the one that you has didn't get bit, did you? the uh, nail gun. Okay, I don't see a nail gun in here. A condor. That's a 10 millimeter weapon. That's cool. Um, I'm going to buy... Uh, I'm going to start buying up... Now Wait a second. That was a good deal. Where is my money? Did I leave it in here? I must have left it in here. I did. Okay. Let's grab that. Marlene! Yeah! Down with ya. Okay. So I'm going to buy up uh, schematics so that we can start making research data because I'm pretty low on research data. So as long as they're not like super expensive, cooling mesh mod. And uh, forget elixir. Oh, she's got some of these re superior repair kits. Oh, that's really good. Okay. Let's buy both of those. Ooh, that's expensive. Oh, uh, you know what? Thanks Actually, hold business. on. I brought some sugar bucks. Let's, you know, let's take those. That'll help a little bit. Um, I made some um, pumpkin cheesecake too, but I forgot to bring it with me. So, okay. So let's go back to here. And uh, where were those? Yeah, let's buy these. We need we need these to upgrade uh, our one of our stations. So. 7200 bucks, Still expensive. That's okay. We're going to make some money, too, from her. What's this do? Uh, shoes. How much is it? 1200 No, we're going to buy it and scrap it. Okay, so I think she doesn't have the the nail gun, but she, you know, just getting those two repair kits was actually worth the price of admission. I hope you come back and see me sometime. Let's close that door. <laughs> Okay, so let's sell some uh, this stuff to her that I want to sell, make a little bit of extra bank. Okay, I think that's it. Remember me if you need medical supplies. Um, we're gonna scrap this. And this, I don't need a cooling mesh bot. I'm gonna scrap that. This in. Uh, I guess we'll scrap that too. Okay, cool. Um, so that gave us a little bit more money. Um, let's buy one of those. I don't need any more sugar butts or shits drops. Red tea, chicken soup. Uh, we'll take the skull crushers, and I think that's all we need from there. Let's go check the guy upstairs. Greetings. Greetings. All right, so what do you have? No schematics in here. No nail guns. Uh, yeah, let's buy that. In fact, I'm going to read that. Uh, we'll buy these for the research data. Uh, 
And I think that's all we're interested in. That SWAT helmet Goodbye. would be nice, but it's pretty low level. Okay, let's learn these. And then we'll scrap all of these. Cool. All right. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to run up to the the desert trader gin now and check out her inventory and then i'm going to stop off at my um oil shale mine that i have up there and grab some oil shale hey look we got a drop let's see what's here nice okay all right so yeah i'll see you guys up at the desert trader gin All right, guys, we are now at Desert Trader Chen. See what she's got in here. If you are here to buy, I've got the best selection of medicine in the wasteland. Okay, I do not see a nail gun in her inventory. However, we'll buy the peas for Shepherd's Pie. She's got 50 steel plating. But I don't think we'll buy those. How much do these cost? Yeah, what the heck? Let's buy those. Okay. And then in her secret stash, she has a bunch of schematics that we could buy. I might actually learn the Forex scope. We already know all of those. Military gloves. Um, yeah, let's buy those, but we're just going to... We're just gonna scrap those for, Thanks for, for the stuff. Business. Stay safe out there. Right. You know, okay. A few things turned up missing the other day. We don't know anything about that. We don't need any of that stuff. Uh, nope. I don't know anything about it. How's it going? It's going. All right. See what you got. I don't see any nail gun there. There's an impact driver schematic. Why don't we buy that and learn it? So that way we we can just make it if we need to. We'll buy that. We'll buy that. Uh, we'll buy that. We'll buy that. Don't we? <clears throat> I still have an extra crucible, so I don't think we need another one of those. Hmm. How much does that cost? Ooh, yowzers. Okay, yeah, we're not buying that. <laughs> That's expensive. Um, we might okay actually need one though at some point for. An upgrade, I'm not sure. Okay, I'm gonna learn this <clears throat> just so I can make it if I if I decide I need to at some point. We're gonna learn the impact driver. And I think everything else we're just gonna scrap for research data. Okay, cool. All right, so no nail gun, but we are getting uh, research data, which we definitely need. Um, so, oh, one of you guys reminded me, too, that I can repair my weapons here. Uh, yeah, sure, we'll do that for a thousand dukes. Um, so, you know, that gives us another option as needed. Okay, so what I'm going to do is go back over to... I'm just wondering if while we're if while we're here, we should see if we could find some more research data. The only man, thing is, is I want to get back to whoa, nice. I want to get back to the wasteland trader, Jana. She's a long ways away before it gets too late. Because if I remember right, I think that wasteland trader, Jen, had a whole mess of research data for sale. Um, so what I'd like to do is get that from her, and <clears throat> if the individual that left me the comment about the nail gun is correct, then she would be the one that would have it, because she's the only other trader gen that I know about on this map. 
So yeah, I think what I'm going to do is go back to my my oil shale mine, <coughs> excuse me, and just mine up um, some oil shale for a little bit. And then I'm going to head over to the Wasteland Trader Gin and we'll check her inventory. So I will bring you guys back when we get over there. <laughs> We've made it to Trader Jets. Uh, a little bit of a crazy ride there. Is this... My infection's back. Great. Must have been from them damn buzzards. Okay. So, let's see. What you got? Um, yeah, she's she's got a whole mess of research data. There it is. All right, awesome. Fantastic. She does have a nail gun. I completely... <laughs> Completely missed that last time we were here. So big kudos to uh, the individual that left that comment. Uh, I don't remember who it was off the top of my head, but uh, you know who you are. Really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Okay, so we're going to buy this. It's actually even really cheap, too. And that gets us our nail gun. Fantastic. All right, now what we're going to do is we're going to... I'm going to sell her a couple of things here. Um, we're going to buy up all her schematics first. Incoming enemies. Because I think 
it's around it's a little over two thousand dollars to to buy 50 of these straight up let's see how much does it cost okay so it's <clears throat> 2025 so anything that's less than two thousand twenty five dollars in, in the way of a schematic it's actually cheaper to buy those than it is to buy the research data straight up um but <clears throat> anything that's more than that it's it's not as cheap so both of those would actually not be worth buying as opposed to putting money into the research data itself but any schematic that's less than we'll just say less than two thousand dollars is worth getting and that uh, doesn't apply to those two so okay what about here okay so that one's worth buying that one is not that one is that you know i think i'm gonna buy this just because we're gonna need it later on even though it is kind of expensive but yeah let's do that and then those uh this one is not worth buying as opposed to just spending money straight up on research data itself okay so i think that's all we want to get from her besides the research data itself so let's scrap this and yeah we know that already right yeah okay so scrap that and My this, have picked up something. this we'll hang on to because we can't learn it until we know we learn first of it get out of here i said no solicitors you too lady i'm not interested okay let's uh let's check this uh don't want chicken ration we will buy a ravioli we'll buy salmon we'll buy rock busters don't need sugar butts we'll take the hackers and the skull crushers i don't think we need any of the rest of that stuff okay let's go see what the upstairs dude Good has to see you okay so he doesn't have any schematics there that's 2160 that's 1350 so that's worth buying um i already have the fireman mod thingy and shotgun aside we're gonna buy that and read it and this is worth buying and scrapping as well what's this a falcon pistol it's a 10 millimeter pistol that's cool but I don't want to buy any weapons because you know we'll we'll eventually be looting weapons okay so I think that's all we want to all get right. from this dude so scrap and scrap and scrap wait do I want to scrap that or yeah I think so because we already have one of those <clears throat> okay cool now what we're gonna do is we're basically gonna take the rest of our money and we're gonna just buy as many uh, research data as we can afford yeah okay so let's do that so how much money do we have left we've got about 10,000 coin okay so can we buy like a thousand of these oh no not even close that costs forty thousand, so that means we can probably only buy about two hundred and fifty. Yeah, we can buy those, and that uses up most of the rest of our money. We can buy two more. Okay, so that leaves us with thirteen hundred and fifty-two research data, which isn't bad actually. Um, and hopefully that'll be enough for us to do some of the upgrades that we need to do. Well, you just brightened my day. You don't happen to have I'm any honey on you. you. Do you? Well, even if you do, guess what? I just burned up all my money, so it doesn't matter. That's okay. We got antibiotics Too bad back in the base. Couldn't help you. Uh, yeah, okay. Next time. Good. So uh, let's head back to the base now and uh, see if we have everything we need to do the um, the maintenance station upgrade. That's the first one I want to do. So I'll meet you guys back at the base. All right, guys, we are back, and um, How may I assist let's you? get a couple things put away here first. Uh, so I have a pretty decent amount of iron with me, so we'll get that 
uh, cooking up here. And I'm um, just going to put a few more things away here first real quick. All right, let's see here. I want to... I'm going to actually make some honey. And speaking of honey, let's run upstairs really quick and just see if there's anything in the beehive. Uh, looks like our crops are quite ready to touch it uh, or harvest yet. Three pieces of honeycomb. That's it? Okay. How many eggs do you guys have? None. Oh, we need to feed them seeds and flowers. I need to get a, a chest up there to just store that stuff in and just keep a supply of it up there. The other thing, too, is I want to get replenish the batteries in my lantern uh, until we get the power back up and running. It doesn't... Uh, the batteries don't seem to last real long in these. There we go. Okay. Put those back there. Uh, all right. So to make honey, let's come over here. Um, I need to. Oh, never mind. We're good. Okay. Yeah, there's my pumpkin cheesecake that I made and then took off without. That's just so like me to do. Honey, honey, honey. What are we missing? Oh, we need plastic bottles. We got lots of those. There we go. Okay, so we'll make that honey. Um, I'm going to keep... Uh, let's just put that and that in there for now and the nail gun. And these things. We'll come back and get them in a moment. I want to grab this chest here and let's grab some chrysanthemums We've got lots of those and what's the most seeds we have pine seeds yeah let's grab some pine seeds and we'll feed the chickens in the apiary do i have to have those in my hand or do i just have to have in my inventory Oh, okay. I just have to have them in my inventory. Nice. Okay. And we'll put flowers in here. Beautiful. Okay, let's grab this. And I'm just going to put it right there for now. And then we'll stick those two in there. Okay, that takes care of that. All taken care of. Um, I don't think I showed you guys this, but off camera. Uh, where the hell am I at? Here we go. Uh, so I moved all of my guns into here. So these are all the guns that I'm currently keeping on hand. Um, I guess that's all just one piece. In here I have <clears throat> mo um, mods and parts, weapon mods and parts. Here I have melee weapons. Um, in here I have armor. And in here I have uh, mods and eyewear. I haven't done anything with this rack yet. So we're slowly getting things situated here. In this room, I've got all of my ammunition materials in this bin and my ammunition moved into that bin. So, yep, that's what we got done so far. All right, so what our first order of business now is we want to uh, we want to get this guy upgraded. So let's go to the upgrade thingy. Let's pin this, and it looks like we have every all of this stuff down here. But we're gonna need titanium, steel, one of the repair kits, and 750 repair data. Oh, and I think it said 40 books, right? We might. We'll probably have to make some books because I only have these 30. Let's grab those, those, and one of these. And I did we need the military fiber too? I think maybe we did. Uh, oh, yeah, we do because it shows us up above. Now, uh, we need 20 of these because this is just a little too far away for the broadcasting to reach. Now, there's supposed to be a thingy we can make for our chest. It's a mod that will increase our 
uh, the range of the wireless. It's new with this update, from what I understand. It's like a, a walkie-talkie looking thing. I'm not seeing it in here. Hmm. You guys were also telling me in the um, comments that if I make one of those those auto miner thingamadoodles, those can sometimes find gems. Um, so we might look into doing that. I, I used those in my first season of Undead Legacy, and I wasn't really impressed with them. They were pretty damned expensive, and they didn't really get you that much stuff. So I don't know. We'll see. Uh, anyway, let's see. Mods. Is that something that we would make in the tailor station? Probably, because it's a clothing or a chest piece. Backpack unlearned. Yeah, I don't see it, man. Hmm. Well, if you guys know, let me let me know. Uh, maybe you have to find the schematic for it or something. It's not something you can just learn. Oh, we need to take our honey before we get to 5% here. There we go. And we need to put a little more fuel in there to finish those off. And we have an abrasion too, so let's uh, take one of these to get that down. And we'll take a health bar to even further reduce the time we got to screw with that. Okay, good. So let's see here. We need a hundred uh, steel plating, which I happen to have for a change. Okay, um, now, does that give us everything? Whoops. Everything probably except for books, right? Yeah, okay. Uh, we're going to probably have to burn some research data to make books, which sucks, but I really want to get this thing upgraded. So, uh, let's see, we're going to need paper, and I already have the research data on me. So let's grab a stack of paper. I'm just going to stick these in particular up here because they are heavy. All right, we need to make 10 books. So that's going to cost us 50 research data and then the paper, but I don't really care about the paper because we got plenty of it. All right, so yeah, that's going to take 3 minutes and 20 seconds to do. So when after that, then we'll see where we are, you know, for getting this guy upgraded. This will be the next thing we'll want to do. I mean, we could do it right now with what we have, but I'd rather get the maintenance station upgraded first and then then we'll focus on this okay so while we're waiting um we need more fuel in here in fact here let's do this let's mm, start making more steel with that and then in here we'll continue to make more iron Good. Okay. We have 622 of those. Let's make another 150. And then I want to make some more concrete blocks. Concrete. There we go. 124. Let's not burn all of our concrete mix. Let's make a, just 100 of those. Very good. Okay, so... Uh, the pumpkin cheesecake, that's essentially a candy uh, because it gives us a buff. So I'm just going to keep that in here with the other candies for now. And where are we at? I think we're in pretty good shape now, actually, guys. So we really just need to do these upgrades. And once those are done, um, you know, then we can start probably getting back to working on continuing you know building out our base here uh, i do want to get this to a tier three too but i don't think that's super essential right at the moment um oh gas yeah we got to start making gas again let's grab all of the partials that we have and we want to consolidate into here okay um Let's do add to container. 
and and then we'll take this one and we'll pull back out of the container and that gives us a full thingy right there and there's still 10 units in there okay good so now we have uh, nine empty gas cans and we should be able to make some gas I brought back uh, a th uh, 1114 oil shale too by the way or close to that anyways okay so <coughs> let's start cooking this up we'll have to come back and pull f once you know these five areas fill out we'll have to come back and pull some out so otherwise it'll just keep burning and screw that up and our books are probably done now let's go take a look see what we got going on here almost almost there we go okay we should have everything we need now to upgrade to the tier 4 maintenance station and then we can start repair uh, re get back to repairing our stuff okay so I'm just double checking here yep that's looking good upgrade boom fan friggin tastic now we should be able to repair um, this stuff Again, I just need to get the materials for it. Uh, since we can repair this now, we don't have to carry this extra M60 around any longer, so we'll put that back in the armory. Uh, right here. Okay, cool. Roberta, you... You're empty, it right? It is a pleasure to serve. Yeah, she's empty. Okay. All right, guys. Well, I think we're in uh, pretty good shape here. So I'm going to... What am I going to do? If we can get enough steel plating... um, I'd have to burn another 50 research data, but... We'd still have enough then to do the upgrade here. I'm going to have to make an impact driver too, though, because we burned our other impact driver. Uh, what does that require? Let's see. That's going to be resources, tools, tools. 15 steel plating. We've got all the rest of that. Um, we want to make sure that we don't accidentally consume the good impact driver. So let's put that in there. Okay. I'm, I might have... Uh, well, actually, I probably do have enough to do this. So I'm going to keep you with me just a little bit longer. Um, so let's start making steel here. Yeah, by the time these... Uh, oh, okay, these are done. So let's turn these also into steel ingots. And yeah, that, that should give us enough to do what we need to do. So let me get all this steel uh, cooked up, and then I'll bring you back, and hopefully we can get this workbench upgraded too before I let you go. Let's make some spaghetti while we're waiting. And we'll make some sham chowder. Or no, let's make some shepherd's pie. And some sham chowder. Good stuff, man. Good, good cracker. There is um there's an old actor who I'm pretty sure has passed on. I'm positive he's passed away. That used to do a commercial for Rich Crackers a long time ago when I was a kid. And he'd take a bite into it and he'd say, Good cracker. If any of you guys can guess who that is and you put it in the comments, you win a hundred worthless old guy points. Okay, so there you go. That's your homework until the next episode. Don't look it up on the internet, too. If you guys Google that, I'll know, okay? 
you have to know without Googling it. Don't cheat. Cheaters never prosper. And they don't survive the apocalypse either, so... Don't cheat. It's not good for you. Alright, while we're waiting for that... Um... Let's make a impact driver. It's just a cheap-ass one, but that's fine. That's all we need for this. Glad I found the schematic for that. Good cracker. That's right. That's what he used to say. Unless you're really super young, or, you know, you've just been living under a rock for the 20th and 21st centuries, most of you probably know who this person is, or have at least heard of his name. Um, do we want to turn all of those into steel ingots? How many do we need? I think we needed 100, right? In fact, here, we should pin this. Yeah, we need 100. So let's just make another 35. I don't want to overmake stuff at this point, because we might need some of those steel ingots for other things. Okay, actually that's good because that still is the 73 ingots that we can make for repairing. Oh, I have seven in here too. Okay, that's even better. That's more better. In fact, let's go ahead and repair that. And we'll repair that. And we'll repair this. Those are only taking iron. Those Didn't those used to take steel to repair? What about you? You take steel. Hmm. I don't know. Okay. So that's got 27 seconds left. Good cracker. Are you thinking about it? You're not cheating, are you? Don't be looking up on Google. I'll know. I'll know if you cheated. Ten seconds. Ah, we're gonna have to make another gear, and we do need uh, steel ingots for that. So let's craft one gear. How did I miscount the plating? You know, oh, because I I just used it to repair those items. That's why. Okay, so we need seven more of these now. The impact driver, she is done. Oh, we needed to make 10 more books, too. Uh, so let's grab the paper. Go back in here. We'll have to burn another uh, 50 research data. I kind of hate doing that because, you know, books are relatively easy to find, but... We're not going to be able to do that until we go out and do some more looting. Rootin' tootin' looting. Okay, so we got our 100 steel plating. We got our extra gear. Um, so we should have everything now except for the books. Oh! We need bolts, too. Okay, so we need to make another 16 bolts. We can do that. Oh, wait a minute. Can we do that? We can't at the moment because I just consumed all of our iron ingots. But we can make some more iron ingots from this scrap. Oh, boy. Okay. So I said we needed 16. Uh, we need... <coughs> you can make five per... So we need at least four. Let's just make five more of these for now. And that should do the trick. I'm going to have to do some mining after this, man. Because this is taking all of our metal. That's a good thing I grabbed all that iron in um, in my, um, uh, whatchamacallit mine. Oil shale mine. There's a big iron vein in there too, so I grabbed. That's where I got all that iron from. Okay, so we just need we need 16 in total to 
to have enough. To have enough. Okay, we should be able to do it now. Um, yeah, we're going to use the cheap impact driver. I keep hitting the wrong thing there. Oh, books, right. Got to get the books. They're probably not done yet either. Nope, one more minute. Are these nail guns the same? This one has a one more meter range. Not that we give a rat's ass about that, because I never use this as a weapon, but since this is the better nail gun, we will keep it and we'll consume the other nail gun. So let's also temporarily put the three meter ranged nail gun in there. Okay, let's get this workbench to tier three. Uh, we need a hammer in our inventory. All right, nice. And that is it. There's no tier four version of this workbench. So we now have a maxed out workbench info screens. Oh, those are cool. We should maybe play around with those a little bit. So I don't know what else this added that we weren't able to make before, but well, it added the superior repair kit. That's what it did. Uh, that's the most expensive thing in there. Okay. Can we make military fiber? I know there's a, a schematic for it. Yeah, it looks like we can. Okay. That's not terrible. But we do need the Tier 3 chem station to do it, though. All right. So let's talk about what's next in terms of upgrades. I think we just have... To get this to tier three and the two beakers are going to be the hard thing about that so we'll have to just keep our eyes peeled mechanics table doesn't upgrade we've got the workbench done artist's table is done carpenter's table is done and so yeah we just have the two forges or the forge and the furnaces to upgrade i don't think this upgrades does it no and yeah so this to tier three and these two crafting stations to tier three, and then I think we're we're all caught up in terms of getting everything upgraded. Uh, does this upgrade one more level? No, nope, it doesn't. Okay, I I don't really need to upgrade this necessarily, but we might. What about the Taylor station? Nope, it doesn't either. Okay, cool. Whew, this is a lot of work, man, getting all this done, but it's a lot of fun, too. Really enjoying it. All right, you guys, I'm going to let you go here, and um, I'll probably do some off-camera mining to replenish my metals, and then in the next episode, we'll probably go out and do some looting, um, just because, I, you know, we, need, we still need more books, we need more research data, we need to find more beakers. So, yeah, I think the tentative plan for the next episode is just to go out and hit some POIs and do some more looting. So... With that, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share the video, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.